There is talk of a feud already brewing among him a celebrity. Get me out of here, campmates, and it involves Jamie Lynn Spears. While she is known for starring in Nickelodeon's Zoe 101, the actress is arguably famous thanks to her big sister Britney Spears, whom she notoriously doesn't get along with. And now it is said Jamie Lynn, 32, is already butting heads with fellow camper and YouTube sensation Nella Rose, according to eagle-eyed fans. Taking to X, formerly known as Twitter, one fan wrote, Hashtag Emma Celeb Jamie Lynn already hates Nella Lowell. Another chimed in, I get the feeling if Nella doesn't do well, every trial will be her and then the campmates will get hungry as no food starts coming back and then they will turn. Possibly a punch up started by Jamie Lynn, now that I could see happening. According to 41 year old Brittany, who Jamie has failed to mention thus far despite being probed about her musical family by Josie Gibson, the younger sister is known for being a bit of a diva and pampered princess who managed to get her own way with their parents. Talking in her new memoir The Woman in Me, Brittany claimed Jamie Lynn became entitled. Describing her driving around in a mini convertible car as a child, she wrote, That's how we all were with Jamie Lynn, you see it, you like it, you want it, you got it. She said she had always been the worker bee in the family and was shocked when she returned home to Kentwood, Louisiana, after her tour. The family dynamic had changed, with her mom left broken following her divorce from their father. However she painted out Jamie to be a spoiled brat, with her every need met. My mom was trying to recover from her divorce from my dad, which she'd finally gone through with, depressed and self-medicating, she could barely get up off the couch, she wrote. My dad was nowhere to be found. And my little sister, well, when I tell you she was a total bitch, I'm not exaggerating. My mom would serve Jamie Lynn while she watched TV, bringing her little chocolate milkshakes. It was clear that girl ruled the roost. Brittany felt unnoticed at the time, and was gobsmacked at how Jamie reportedly spoke to their mom. And the way adolescent Jamie Lynn spoke to my mother, my mouth would just drop. I'd listen to her spew these hateful words, and I'd turn to my mother and say, Are you going to let this little witch talk to you like that? I mean, she was bad. I felt betrayed by how Jamie Lynn had changed. I'd bought a house for Jamie Lynn to grow up in. She was not exactly grateful for it. She'd later say, Why'd she get us a house? Like it was some sort of imposition. And during her time of need when she fought to get out of her conservatorship, she claimed her sibling wasn't there for her. The toxic singer insisted that she had capitalized on the harrowing ordeal instead. Jamie Lynn released a 2022 memoir, Things I Should Have Said, Family, Fame, and Figuring It Out, which saw Britney threaten legal action. Writing in her memoir, Brittany addressed the conservatorship being suspended in November 2021, with Jamie not having her back. I was left with so many emotions, shock, relief, elation, sadness, joy. I felt betrayed by my father, and sadly, by the rest of my family, too. My sister and I should have found comfort in each other. But unfortunately, that hasn't been the case. She added, as I was fighting the conservatorship and receiving a lot of press attention, she was writing a book capitalizing on it. She rushed out salacious stories about me, many of them hurtful and outrageous. I was really let down. Shouldn't sisters be able to confess their fear or vulnerability to each other without that later being used as evidence of instability? 
for Jamie Lynn, growing up in the Hit Me Baby One More Time singer's shadow was tough. Sometimes I feel like I don't really have anything for myself, she wept on US TV. I'm extremely proud of my sister but also have my own identity. And following Britney's remarks about escaping her conservatorship, Jamie hit back at disgruntled Britney fans saying, maybe I didn't support her the way the public would like me to with a hashtag on a public platform, but I can assure you I've supported my sister long before there was a hashtag, and I'll support her long after. The star also appeared to confirm an article claiming she was the only family member not on Britney's payroll and revealed she had tried to set up ways to end Britney's conservatorship. In recent times, their rocky relationship appears to have been patched up. Britney publicly posted that it was nice to have seen her sister in an Instagram post, where she praised her sibling. It was nice to visit my sister on set last week. I've missed you guys so much, she wrote this summer. Despite their complicated history, Britney wishes the absolute best for Jamie Lynn and her family. I'm working to feel more compassion than anger toward her and toward everyone who I feel has wronged me, she admitted. It's not easy. It's thought Britney might even show her face during the friends and family segment of Emma Celebrity this year. Speaking of her expected appearance, an insider told The Mirror, Jamie Lynn has got decades of history and bad blood with Britney to rake over and has laid out her feelings pretty clearly in her own book. It will be interesting to hear her spill the beans about her life and her family and the controversial conservatorship, and to find out whether the sisters really do get along now, or not. However Jamie Lynn failed to mention her famous sister in the promo video for this year's I'm a Celebrity and many fans believe a cryptic post by Britney is now aimed at her younger sibling. She posted an Ernest Hemingway quote on Instagram, which read, All things truly wicked start from innocence, and captioned it with a pink flower emoji. One follower commented, Your sister for example. She's about to go in the jungle and us Brits are ruthless. We've got your back hun. Another posted, Hi Brittany I hope you enjoy Jamie Lynn suffering on I'm a celeb I'll definitely be putting my votes on her to do every Bush Tucker trail. I'm a celebrity continues every night at 9pm on ITV and ITVX.